Now, like many of us, uh, domestic goddess Nigella Lawson is going on a post-lockdown diet. But just hang on there. It doesn't mean she is ditching dessert or foregoing fondue. Instead, she's doing the friendship 5-2 because she's got so used to not seeing her friend. She says for two evenings a week or maybe just lunches and at the weekend, I will pretend to be a normal person, letting those strange entities people into the garden and apply myself to learning how to have a conversation again. I completely understand what she means. Do you think we should all be taking a leaf out of her book, Janet? I thought her article was brilliant because when lockdown started, we were like, oh, we miss our friends so much. And all my friends were talking to each other on Zoom every night. And then I said to one friend, I'll phone you tomorrow at seven. She went, oh, I'm busy. I've got Zoom cocktails, went Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And, you know, people are all Zooming away, chatting away. And then I noticed as it went on, they all went a bit <laughs> quiet off. because the fact of the matter is it's exhausting <laughs> being positive. And what you, all right, you only have to put your top half on. But... The other thing in her article, which was fascinating, she said, oh, but I've gone down to only changing the sheets uh, once a fortnight. And I thought, well, actually, I'd, I changed the sheets, I washed them, but then I fold them up and then I thought, oh, I can actually think that I can get in a sheet that's creased now. Oh, you know what? I'm not going to... I am going to get in a creased sheet. I'm just going to pull it a bit and then I'm going <laughs> to lie on it and flatten it out. But I can't... I'll tell you what, I, I uh, Nigella said mm. she's gone feral, right? Yeah. I've gone feral. I can't iron a pillowcase, but they're all stacked up. And now I think I might have to buy a couple more pillowcases because I've actually run out. <gasps> I can't iron. I just can't iron. I have. I've. I mean, I've. I've let things slide. You know, there's more dust on the surfaces and things are a little bit more cluttered. But that is the one thing I've kept too. I still iron on my sheets. Do you? Yeah. No. I sleep better if they're ironed. But when you stretch them, don't they just go straight? Not in the same way. They're just, oh, they're mm. just lovely. I love an iron, an iron under sheet, an iron duvet cover, iron pillowcases, everything. Well, I'm I from a, I'm I don't from even a... care if you think it's over the top. I just sleep better. <laughs> I'm from a mother who, who goes by the Quentin Crisp thing, which is, what was it, Janet, that after four years just doesn't get any worse? <laughs> <laughs> so that was, yeah. So that was my mother's philosophy always. Um, but I have, I'm married to someone who has been trying to socially isolate since the 1980s, I right. think, with Lincoln. <laughs> yeah. And I think that in 20 years' time, when hopefully, well, long before this is all a bad memory, Lincoln will still be going into voluntary lockdown. Right. On, on, yeah. <laughs> so it's, um, I am a much more gregarious person, but I have, I totally relate to, to what yeah, Nigella said. Yeah. I loved that early lockdown when I knew that my kids were safe, they were both together, they weren't getting on a plane, they weren't getting in a car, there was no danger to them. Well, yeah. you know, as long as they were being careful. And we just loved our little sort of sneaky, you know, time yeah, together. Yeah. And I think that I mean, I've never been an ironer of, I've never been an ironer of, of sheets or, or <laughs> stuff, stuff like that. And I am a tidy person trapped in the body of somebody untidy. So I don't know how I managed to create chaos with only me and Lincoln. And why do I keep having to get a skip? Where is it coming from? Where is my skippable skip. rubbish coming from? I don't... I mean, I love a skip. I Do you not love a skip? I love a skip. But I keep... Lincoln goes, why are we getting another skip? And I go, I don't know, I haven't been out. I haven't bought anything. <laughs> so where is it coming from? Maybe there's people ferreting away in your attic, just putting oh things in. Oh, my God, honestly. <laughs> so, um, so I do think there is something to that. I do see my friends, and I am so... You know, but I am thrilled at the end of the Zoom quiz. Yes. I am thrilled that we've taken the family quiz from three times a week to two, because yes. if I see one more image <clears throat> of my dad's right eye or of him upside down, or do you know what I mean? Yeah. It, it's just... It you, I know you love a Zoom thing. quiz. Well, yeah, but like I said last week, I've, I've been loving this. This 5-2 thing is what I've been doing. Yeah. Two, two nights a week, I've been getting together with, with the Derbyshire family and doing the quiz and doing the bingo and yeah. loving every minute. And when that finishes, I'm like... Oh, do we have to go now? But we we continuing to talk on that, yeah, and I yeah. find it really, really, it's so much fun. But for me, what I've been doing with the other days is just chucking myself into house stuff. I've painted the outside with masonry paint. I've done the garden. I've built a, a multi gym yesterday. A multi gym. It, yes. 
because I can't get to the gym, can I? So I'm putting on weight. You put it all together yourself. Put, well, myself and, and my children, okay. they helped. Yeah, but yeah. it took us about seven hours. It but would. it was the, the, a very therapeutic seven hours. And I love that. But what I'm finding is my friends will phone me up and they'll be like, OK, Brenda, we're going to this. And I'm like... OK, so who's going to be there yeah. and what? And right. I find myself now up? asking red those sort involved? of questions. <laughs> I, I just want to know who's that... Because, again, I am that nervous, anxious person yeah. about has everybody else been doing following rules and, and things like that? So I like the 5-2. I'll keep the 5-2 until yeah. it's... I hope the Zoom nights out in stays. Yeah, because I'm not very fun. good at going out. And the, I love that Nigella says as well, what is this madness of leaving your house at night time? Yeah. <laughs> I, would, my I love staying in, though. <laughs> I stay in wherever I love it. Yeah, we love Nigella. Now we just like her even more.